Moffat Round and his wife Lavnes Poso used to wake up early in the morning to fetch firewood for the domestic use. The couple from Goronga village in Mudzi district who travel long distances in search of firewood in the nearby mountains in a district which now resembles a desert. However, for Lavnes Poso, life has greatly improved for a family since the day they were introduced to another alternative form of energy biogas. after going through training and provided with technical assistance from a local non-governmental organization, the Round family constructed a biodigester which uses a mixture of Jatropha seed cake and cow dung to produce energy for their lighting and cooking needs. Since then, life has never been the same for the family. Biogasiri, kushanda kwa rondi, kunondi fadza, nukuda kukuti. Arina uzi, unokanga nisa utano, uye jeri no biga neku kurumiza. Uye mumba macho, amukanga nisike, kano tevana kukanga nisa utano, seja tayu mweta kukanga nisika utano ne uzi. Saka pariju neji, ndaona uti biogas, raka naka. Miti chaya chayo ndimenda nikitema miti. Nefurachu <laughs> Kachera <laughs> The biodigester at the family's homestead has proved an attraction in the village where other villages have begun constructing their own biodigesters. Ne biogas, the chitarisa, my battery, go attribute one one and go to Shanduka was in what you are to Shuira, put the data once a guaki home with Zimbabwe. Chite deforestation ishoma, yekutema miti, nezimwe shwakadaro kana zipuyo, zinokwansa kuwanao, 
chikafu chaka kwa na kuburiki zamu ni environment inenge awa pu. Ah, inini sukuto ni samu sauti shua eri kuti magetsi anga pufiti. Sukuto tuto kupenda ra chai sukuti dai. Tika tu yao na chipe puta kati no para chai su. Ende tuto kuto para ni chaka ari kuti projecti weiga muno mfridge ya kana kwa su. No tangu pe zamu inti tishi tema ininda ishani za ngorosi kisipamba pangu pa gore. Misa angoranda ito paraja. Asiye njenja nisha ziviku enda musamu, musango. Ninyo ya yei, ye mabayo gasi. Mabayo gasi hama zangu haka na haka. Tongo tola siti keki ye maja, tulofa nendo eze mwobe. Moto kufatu seni nishungo bika, neva sikuru, neva rora, uskata enda kunorara. Bio gas is an alternative form of energy that can substitute traditional fuels like firewood and is suitable for rural household cooking, heating and lighting. Biogas production through anaerobic digestion gives quality cooking fuel and a slurry output that can be used as fertilizer. I bagged the endo in the half. Those are to know Sanganisane half bagged the seed cake. To Kanya, so to Saruza, a Marara, Anoya Pamsoro. Mutendele kutu mpinde mara. Lente ya kanya, tinenge taka vara na shpaibi. Tozo vura, shopinda, tienda mdai jesta. Leni, shingura mba tishidaro, kwa zuare gareka. Pa manyowa, anova mdai jesta. Anondi basira shwa kanyanya. Nukuda kwa ukuti, ma fertilizers. Dingati fertilizers ya chopache shwa emu shopu. Ino dura sipa kushanda kwa ino to kundwa ne digester ni manyo ano vamu digester saka manyo ane simba guru shoguti uno gona kuita manyo e pasi ne pamu soro pa mwechete pa iwa ya manyo ya shoguti chikafu chikafu chino kura shaka naka uye shaka nada uri muriwo unyanya seta zishi jari no chikisa kanari madomasi unyanya seta zidomasi ompe chairo chairo. It was joy and jubilation at the Round Homestead recently when villagers gathered to witness the handover of the digester to the family. The biogas digester plant in a pan of Patinotipa inland, pa inlet, no pan of Pinda, Nepushka, a quick digester, it turned up, no panes, the Garingiro Rachore, Aragakura, almost two meters for Kureba. They almost again 1.9 kukwa kupara. This was a trip up up. Uko, zuna kizwa kubila zwa kuenda kuzwa kuda umu. Zwondo pinda kupi, uko. Woto hawa izo, zwa hota nza kuta zei. Pida manyowa, pida mumu ndani uma garden. This was a, and then he pan up, changoti mchidimbu. Wachati one sakuta wano fida zei. Asi wachita, wachita kukumu jwa kutura zwa hindi chini ngirina. Wachikutura, chine ndove, pazware garega. Wane nda hafu mgoro, wendowe. Right. They are still noted daily feeding. Watikanya zwao, chini ichochi, chino rarama kwe makore 50, 60 years. Life spike out di kurarama kwachi, kara chika batu wa zwakanaka. Osanga nisa zwao, nemi guro ya o 4, ye mbura. Ah, ite, ni mwati. Apo oneka watisanga nisa, nofunga muruko ona kana mine, dungwe zwakaita zumamiti, zumachi, waringo wachi visa. Chikon zero, waka zisa izozi, jino zondo bloka uko, wakire la rikaita se, harichanya chobudi zwa kanaka. Tokanga nisa, kukula kwe gas. Dati chini, jichino jika mazwa ese, jika mwafana na ne mundu, kuno kutuite utano, jino laku jika mazwa ese. Dozo waka fana ne pano, jino laku jika mazwa ese, kuita uritirambe tichuona, gafire liroro. Eu vou lá nego a te dizer isso. Que tá a mirar para não apagar. Tá a tua mirar para gomba. Diz o que? Para que tenta o baú com o pai. Quando chega o co. Ninguém tá a tua pina. Ninguém tá a ir a se. Ninguém tá a pirar. Ninguém tá a ir. 
Kuyagumba <laughs> Biogas is a mixture of gases, primarily methane and carbon dioxide, produced by the biological breakdown or fermentation of organic matter in the absence of oxygen, scientifically referred to as anaerobic digestion. The biogas digesters comprise an inlet chamber, main dome expansion chamber, and slurry outlet for liquid waste. Kara uchida kwa giri wa digester, kwa kwanza ukunga ni zomari yako ino kwanza kita 1,200, kwa kwanza kuwaka 6 cubic digester. Kune ma 4 cubic, kune ma 6 cubic, ma 9 cubic, ni ma 13 cubic, anuwa nro ma domestic. Asi, tingango depa 1,200, kwa kwanza kuwaka 6 cubic. Pa 6 cubic, pano diwa cement, zino kwa na kita eh, 23 bags, 3 PC15. Kwa kita ajitina, pano diwa 1,000 bricks. Kweta river sand, panodiwa mabararo kwa nasa kita 24. Kweta pit sand, panodiwa magare mabararo kwa nasa kita 24. Nema three quarter stones, 24 wheel barrels. Mutoko kwa wei posiku, sakanya nisa. Nukuda kwa kuti, miti chayo fanike pana patanga tesina miti. Ndo patai wana unizo kubikisa. Saka andane bayagasi. Muti uh, atiteme teme pese pese. Pane kamu kana kekuti mitiri kukura. Nukuda kwe bagas. Kashi nituwe shanisa bagas. Pane kaka na mvurai china ya. Tika vakumu nda tongo shikatubati za bagas. Echa akuto bika choku choku. Makuseni ni wazu kuro ngondo gara nao. Ajinditua re rengua. Nduno kasira ugazira vana chikafu. Pasina uuni. Kashi tambira chini chakana kacha hizu. Katika fungwe kuti ndo ingaite moto ungabike sadza wanga uo inga uonezkwe takashi tambira shaka nyanyi sano kuti shaka tibatira kuti ticha chenge teza masangwa ya niti kutema ticha ya ita kutema kushoma access to reliable energy sources is vital for the improvement of livelihoods especially in rural areas where many communities are living in extreme poverty and rely on firewood for heating and cooking. The National Domestic Biogas Program in Zimbabwe is successfully developing a market-driven domestic biogas sector with over 150 biogas digesters having been constructed so far, with Mozi District having one of the largest bio climate change mitigation, adaptation, and poverty reduction is a core objective of almost every African country's development agenda. Most countries have realized that for communities to mitigate the effects of climate change, adapt and reduce poverty, they should have adequate energy supplies such as biogas energy. Promotion of biogas is important in the sense that uh, it's a waste management strategy. Uh, it's also uh, an alternative source of energy. We have noted that uh, there is an increase in tree cutting or scarcity of energy is increasing by day. So when you promote this uh, biogas energy, it, it substitutes uh, the demand or it reduces the demand for firewood, thereby enhancing or helping in the 
in the in the reduction of deforestation. In Manikaland, some schools have adopted biogas in order to address their energy challenges as well as for sustainable waste management and nutrient recycling. Yeah, pano ba shikuru zaka taka ni wanita agriculture ni wanita geography matisha siyo zaka waka matona ni ni weema ndi wakarunga kuti ti agiwe ba digester zaka taka pua muna no siwa kuwaka isusi taka provider zaidi kana zaka taka zo waka that ba digester kuto ni kuti the waste that comes out of the figure project can be made uh, into something useful. Saka one of the things that it can be used as a biogas uh, through the biogas digester. We say this we generate uh, a source of power. You know, with the um, uh, outages. Uh, the biogas will come here and, and our students will not lose out in terms of start and learning. So we use the pigs to produce energy from their sources, right? We use a biogas digester. So what happens is there's a biogas digester which is connected to the pig guard, at the pig guard. So that biogas digester is the one that converts the feces into the energy used to produce electricity. So we decided to use the biogas due to its convenience and its efficiency. Cause like, yeah, there are a lot of other fuels that can be used, like the soil and stuff, but the pigs are readily available. They're always there. No matter it's bad weather or what, it's always there and we can always get our electricity right. St. Matthias High School in Manikaland is another institution that has adopted the use of biogas energy for cooking. This is where we start. We start by opening our stove, our gas here. Then we use the biogas energy as a It makes a, a whistling sound. You can hear the sound. So our gas is open, then you can smell it now, then we go. Our stove is on now, so that's our gas stove. That's how it works. Then we can cook, we can boil. Like for now, I can put this kettle with water. We boil our water for tea while we are cooking our egg sandwich. Now that we have this one, which is a, a, a cheaper resource, it is easy. And now for our students, this one is also used as a learning aid, not only for the food science students, but for all the other science students and other subjects. So they can now use this apparatus as a learning aid. They now know that it is a resource that is there, that is even available in their homes. What is important is for them to just build the, bio, the biogas digester and maybe connect the apparatus that they want to use. According to Obvious Chikata, the headmaster of St. Matthias High School, the biogas project at the school has proved effective in terms of reducing the electricity costs. Marito, but I don't get here to the because the dark shanties are the same water shanties are gas or bigaku food size. But I shall summon gas it, I shall say that bio digester, gas it, I shall not do it to shantisa. In the Panagabasna, it is good to take a papo because Togo shantisa, my waste and guru, you eat in a summum, then you gas will be pa, then to Tobika, who pitch in the goom, the goom malebs. Sagabatsa would sixa, cost. Yes, Sabatsa would sixa, a wound the Tesu shantisa kitchen. 
kuti kashinji tiro tenga kuni mapuranga kuti ya tumiki sabana saka kusi ya zika uizui ya bati kapa kuti ya tisha urai miti ya kawanda wakujini wakuona mwoto ya tinushandisa when, when, when you are using firewood at such a big school just imagine the quantity of firewood that is being used on a day to day basis and that can translate to the number of trees that are being cut on a day to day basis so when you promote this biogas what it means is um, deforestation is going to be reduced at length we have also noticed that there are quite a number of projects at that school like um, pigar project and the school was grappling with the management of their effluent it is estimated that about 50 million trees are disappearing from forests in the country every year currently we've noted that uh, if you look at our, um, our our environment like the area that is surrounding Mutare, it's depleted of trees as people go out there looking for firewood so when you promote this uh, biogas energy what it means is less and less trees are going to be cut from from the environment it's also a waste management strategy because this biogas we are deriving it from waste uh, the feces, uh, the human, the animal waste that is generated on a day to day basis. So it's also a waste management strategy. So, what we are simply saying is we are promoting um, waste management at the same time, deriving some livelihood out of that. Another school that has adopted the use of simple technology to develop clean, affordable, and easily accessible energy in Manikaland is St. James Zungoro High School. Uh, one of the things really very useful is, is the use of the Mvura Inobudamo Nwacho. It's being, being used to irrigate my, 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 my trees, I do it now, my orchard trees, in you know, part of the garden. You know, the immediate use of the And we have seen that very helpful. It is an improvement because as a school, we are able to use the gas that is produced today for our studies. For example, in science, we have some topics which require practical and it is of use for us. We can also use it as a community because there is a reduction of deforestation. <coughs> my subjects are going to say home economics. Now I have a chibika, a chibika, a chibika, a chibika, a biogas. A chibika, a chibika, a chibika, a chibika, a chibika, a chibika, a Biogas technology is a simple technology that does not require sophisticated capacity to construct and manage it. According to experts, a minimum of 3 to 4 kettle are enough to produce 20 to 30 kgs of fresh cow dung daily, which is then fed into the biodigester, enough to meet the heating, cooking and lighting needs of most people in the rural areas. As long as the, the, the pigs are generating effluent, then we are guaranteed of energy. As long as our cows are producing cow dung, we are guaranteed of energy. As long as our chickens produce the, the, the waste, we are guaranteed of energy. So it's renewable and it's very sustainable. It is refreshing to know that, apart from households, even institutions such as schools are beginning to adopt the use of biogas energy across the country. So today we should go to my my head master. I think I started saying, "Emma, I saw one of the other wing. But one or two at least, I got to one of them. I started to chat with my mate. Is this to talk to us? My friends, and I got to one of them. I got to wait no survival environment. And I think my head master is this. It's cool. This is because we have to copy pan. So because gas is now no cheaper. No chance to go waste. Then we have no chance to go kitchen. My lips are. It can have uh, my initial cost. But we, the ultimate benefit, I think, is going to, it is going to upset those um, uh, initial costs. I, I, I see it as viable. And I would like to encourage other schools to do the same thing, because if we were able to do it, why can't they? This 
energy is quite safe, quite reliable, quite clean. So there is no need to be afraid. I'm calling all Zimbabweans to embrace this form of energy as it will save our trees out there. And when we save our trees, what it means is we have saved our carbon sinks and the fears of climate change could be, could be, could be minimized. I'm searching for the